looks like Jurassic Park. Yeah, it's JP, one of my favorites. Probably Ron's top film, though. Probably the 20th time he's seen it. Or first, depending on how you want to keep track. Get out of there, Goldblum! I mean, I love movies. I mean, it's like maybe one in like, 50 movies where you watch it and you just feel alive, you know? And you feel a little silly mm -hmm. because you know it's fake. You know it's a movie. Sure. But your heart's racing, even though you're telling it. You're telling it not to. Yeah. Ron gets a little caught up in movies. Who doesn't? Who doesn't? Who doesn't? I mean, I want to run away from that boulder in Indiana, ride along with Butch and Sundance, or sleep with those girls from Cruel Attentions, a mm. wild thing. Yeah, for real. <laughs> you don't know what's going to happen next, so it becomes like a vacation from your work or traffic. And it's an experience. I guess it started technically in grad school. I was at UCLA for neuroanatomy and started getting really into film. And basically, I was working over at Vidia's off of Pico in Santa Monica. It's like the last great video store. And Matt would come in and we just talk movies. Well, then a team out of Boston University discovered you could stop a mind from accessing memories by paralyzing large sections of the brain. In my thesis, I theorized that the mind maps memories visually. If you could get a computer to scan for a particular image that you feed to it, it could find where it is in the brain's memory stores. Matt explained it to me. I didn't get it at all. So he explained it to me again using movie terms, and I got it. I was like, wouldn't it be great if we could use this to watch movies again like it was the very first time? You know, mind erasing shit like Eternal Sunshine or Total Recall or Men in Black or Dark City. So once the machine locates the image or images that I feed into it, it paralyzes that section of the brain. We figured out since you have to put something into the program, you can't say, oh, I'd like to forget the time I was bullied in school. It'd be like trying to develop a picture without the negative. So you can forget you saw, say, a painting, but that's about it, except for movies. Yeah, who wouldn't want to see their favorite movie again for the very first time? Have all those spoilers unspoiled, all those repeat viewings undiminished. You know, feel those feelings again, but for real, not just the ghost of them. And we also found it had other uses. Bye-bye, Battlefield Earth. So long, Congo. You're watching those again? Why? I'm just erasing them. Some movies I don't want to have in here. Cradle to the Grave, DMX the Actor, I gave you a chance. You blew it. <laughs> Sucks by Unless, I wonder if DMX acts as good as he raps. Don't, don't, don't. Stop. Drop. Shut him down, open up. Don't watch this movie. We're finding that the brain tends to resist the effects of the machine. So you have to increase the amperage just to get the same effect. But more juice leads to longer memory blackout periods once you get them to work. But, I mean. Worth it. Yeah, who cares? <laughs> Matt, you got... Tom Hanks marathon? Oh, no, Star Wars. Hubert, what are you in the mood for? I have to go to work. So do you. This is our work. Call in. Hitchcock. Every movie from the beginning. Yes! Day 15, awesome times, yet again. Popcorn levels are at 60%. <laughs> Planes, trains, and automobiles. What was your department, buddy? <laughs> Those aren't Philip. <laughs> I mean, I just like Willow better than Blade Runner. You can't. <laughs> Ron! Ron, it's Blade Runner. Willow. We're talking about Blade Runner. 
I'm talking about Willow. Blade Runner. Willow. Blade Runner. Willow. Blade Runner. Willow. People are gonna love it. I love it. Ron loves it. I definitely love it. People are gonna love it. Like my cousin plays Xbox all day long. He's got thousands of other idiots doing it with him. That's just how people have fun now. Yeah. Uh, Netflix, on demand, binge watching, it's the same thing. Like, this is just the next level of perfecting that. <sighs> you get it? Can we go back to the garage now? I'm a little worried. Ron and I haven't been out for like a month, and he's always suggesting we have a movie night. You wanna watch Cocktail? Uh, we've seen Cocktail, baby. Oh, <laughs> we, you don't get this machine. <laughs> 12 times. Nobody needs to watch Cocktail that many times. That's always kind of been like this. He's good and he's sweet. I just think if he had trouble meeting people before, this machine really isn't helping. Hi, Mom. Um, I brought you some cookies. Um, I don't, no thank you, no thank you, I'm, I'm actually working. I haven't tried it, have you? Oh, no, no. But I want to. Ray Charles got his girlfriends hooked on heroin. I mean, to be honest, if I could see Bridges of Madison County again with fresh eyes, I mean, I, I guess I would do it. This whole place looks like a mess. I know, Mom, I know. I would like to get my car back in there, though. I've been forgetting a lot of things lately. Uh, birthdays, work, where I left my keys, that kind of stuff. What was I saying? Hey man, um, I don't know what to say. We had to hire a new person to cover you. Uh, he's doing the job and we can't hold him back waiting for you, so. Uh, I hope you're okay. Call us, please. I, I think what we need is just a little more testing, and then this thing takes off. We just need to regroup and get our bearings. That's just all. bearings. Just bearings. A little tweak here and there. Yeah, just tighten a couple screws. I don't know what to do with this. Matt, did you remember to pay the power bill? Pay the power bill? With what? You're supposed to be the science guy. I'm the movie guy. Come on. Man, I can't deal with this. It's like pitch black in here. Did you hear that? Poltergeist. Jesus, relax. Watch a movie or something. I can't watch a movie, Matt. The machine works on power! Things, things did get a, a, a little bit crazy, a little bit. Um, Matt had to go away for a while, but he'll be back, he'll be back. And you know, I've just been keeping the place together in his steed, you know? Uh, we had some issues, had some power issues, I figured those out, maybe maybe I'm the smart guy, you know? I, I mean, I'm not the one that went away. <laughs> so, you know, you know, we got power, we got power. With all the power that we need, all day long, all night long. Watch as many movies as we want, no problem. Everything's gonna be great. Just, you know, just, just, just kind of holding down the fort till Matt gets back, and then we can continue to build our empire. You know, this is, it's, it's gonna be big. I, I know it. I'm not even get a boat. Yeah, it's a simple. You know, it's gonna be great. <laughs> yeah. Well, uh, I was in jail, but I don't want to talk about that right now. You want to watch Shawshank? No. I already told you it wasn't anything like that. 
Normally, how long do you think you guys can go without using the machine? Well, we only use it to watch movies. And how many movies do you watch per day? Since being back? 25, 30, but not all the way through. We don't always watch a movie all the way through. 50. Tops. What we have here is a failure to communicate. Reality. Reality sucks, man. Reality bites. You, you, wanna, you wanna watch that? We love movies. And love means never having to say you're sorry. You can't handle the truth! Today, I consider myself the luckiest man on earth. If you build it, he will come. I'm the he, Matt built it. But you guys are totally addicted to movies. Well, nobody's perfect. I'd rather have 30 minutes of wonderful than a lifetime of nothing special. It doesn't matter what happens tomorrow or the rest of my life, because I'm happy now. I'm the king of the world! This is our time, our time, down here. Roads, where we're going, we don't need roads. yippee ki -yay, motherfucker. It's like Jurassic Park. Yes, yeah, JP, one of my favorites. Probably Ron's top film, though. This is the 20th time you've seen it? Or first, depending on how you want to keep track.